So this, that is a thing. Okay, Edgar's up there. I just have to go up there. Wait. Perhaps I should go after the missing ingredients first. I believe I shall do so. Why the quest? So I can unselect Edgar. I'm confused. Where the hell is Edgar? Well, color me confused. Fuck it. I guess I'll just go talk to Edgar Swansea. Get that shit over with. Oh no, wait. Please, Jonathan, come in. Fascinating, is it not? In the last decade, so many mysteries have been brought to light with our microscopes. The human body, biology's penultimate frontier. The more we explore its boundaries, the less we're able to trace a clear line between life and death. Why is that so fucking low res? <laughs> you, my friend, have a foot in both countries. The view must be vertiginous. It's at least as vertiginous as chatting about vampires with you, I would say. <laughs> this must be all so new to you. This area of town, the hospital, a brand new life. How stimulating it must be. I wish I could share your enthusiasm, Dr. Swansea. Fucking... But my condition defies scientific categorization. Yes. Undead? Unalive? Immortality defies logic. That it I does. I cannot express my thrill at this serendipitous turn of events. The world's most eminent specialist in blood transfusions, a vampire. One might say a gift from heaven. <laughs> it may seem strange, but your words have brought me some comfort here. Forgive me. I've been an admirer of your work for a long time, and now you are so much more than a brilliant physician. And please, call me Edgar. There is no need to apologize, Edgar. You offered me sanctuary yes. when I had none. Very well. I have a task for you, Jonathan. Something that will require all your newfound skills. Please, go on. The Pembroke only survives through the generosity of our benefactors. Unfortunately, our main donor has found herself in a bit of a bind. Now, if you could help her out... A spokesman or politician is what you need. That's not my calling. And until I come to understand what has happened to me, I require discretion. Yes. Discretion is in order, Jonathan. Lady Ashbury has recently received rather indelicate correspondence that if revealed would jeopardize her position so in other words she's being like she's being blackmailed eradicate this threat by the stole of course not i would just like you to pay her a visit 
Her ladyship is certainly near the tents outside, tending the sick. You can't miss her. Look for someone impossibly delicate. Accepted. I'll see what kind of trouble Lady Ashbury is in. Hmm. Alrighty then. Well, it's been an hour, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment with feedback. Like if you enjoyed, and subscribe if you'd like to see more. Engineer, signing off.